All right, guys, a little update on my uh, Ender 3. Yes, I am a noob. Please don't make fun of my taped-on bed. Uh, the paper clips that came with it are way too small for the glass bed, so uh, i got to get some paper clips. Just wanted to do a test print, so I uh, just taped it on real quick because I know my print's going to be there in the middle. Um, yeah, so if you guys didn't see in my previous 3D printing videos, basically I got this. And uh, I found out the hard way after a lot of research that all the beds that come with these Ender 3s are warped. And I think a lot of people said they were low in the middle. Um, my bed is high in the middle. So no matter how I would try to level it, if I would get it level for the corners, it would be too close in the middle and vice versa. Um, so I ordered this glass bed and it seems to have solved all my issues at least uh, i mean this print has some issues but I, I don't think it's bed related but this is the best i printed the same this is a soft jaw for a vice and i printed the same one probably 10 or 12 times and this is the best it's ever looked by far i think these issues down here are just it trying to build on top of nothing i guess until it gets going but uh yeah so the glass bed um seems to have solved all my issues with the ender 3 so if you have an ender 3 and you're having issues with it i probably wouldn't even bother trying to fix them i wouldn't even probably mess with it until you get the glass bed because it's just so much easier and if you do get the glass bed just realize you're going to need bigger paper clips so all right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to keep you updated on some 3D print stuff as I, as I learn this. I am a noob, and uh, I'll probably put up some cool time lapses of some, of some prints as well. Thanks for watching. Later.